Greetings, hi, the War Al greets you, and welcome to a very special edition of Matchmaking Academy, where you are the star for all the wrong reasons, and War Al talks for a very long time. I've received hundreds of submissions for Matchmaking Academy for our relaunch. Something keeps popping up. This is about one in every five submissions. Little Apple, Legendary Eagle, that's her. I have problems with being inconsistent, and I would really like some help. Juice Planet, Gold Nova 2, that's her. I find myself being very inconsistent. In my games, I sometimes begin a game very well in pistol round, but my focus drops. This guy didn't include his favorite fish. What a new! Maijin Vegeta, Silver Elite, that's here. Haddock. Greetings, Warel. Wow, you actually do have nice hair. I have a few questions about consistency in gameplay. Consistency, consistency, consistency. This isn't something we can show positions for and go through the gameplay demos. This is something we gotta talk out. How do you expect to perform consistently if you are not consistent? Do you wake up at the same time every day? Do you eat three balanced meals at the same time every day? Do you exercise regularly? Do you get all of your work done? Are you maintaining your relationships? Do you watch every War Owl video, like and comment, even the sponsored ones? What does this have to do with Counter-Strike? If you are not a consistent person, you're not going to perform consistently. This goes toward everything. If you really want to get good at Counter-Strike, if you're committed to that, then you're going to have to form some good habits. Lacking consistency in your play can come from a number of different areas, but it tends to have the same solution. Let's say you're inconsistent because you lose confidence in your play. So you're playing along as normal, you get killed in a dumb way or you miss your shot and you lose all confidence. All of a sudden you don't push when you should, you're missing your shots, you play like garbage. And you were playing fine just a second ago. I say this a lot, competence leads to confidence. If you learn the game to the point of unconscious competence, meaning you don't have to think about it when you play, you just do it, then no matter what happens, no matter what situation pops up, you're just going to do. You're going to be in the zone. So how do you get there? How do you get to that point? Consistent practice habits. If you're not consistent in your play, you have to get consistent in your preparation. It takes repetition. It takes repetition. If you ever just hop onto your computer and go right into a 5v5 competitive match, you're doing yourself a disservice. You're turning your first match of the day into your practice match and you will play inconsistently. You won't play the same as you play in the second match. It's gonna mess up your brain a little bit. You have to develop a consistent practice schedule. I don't know what that looks like for you. You're gonna have to find out what works for you. There's aim practice. There's practicing just shooting bots in the head. There's deathmatch. There's retakes, which are really nice. There's going through the maps and going over the different positions and the different peaks. Practicing your flashes. Practicing the smokes that you're gonna throw for the specific match that you're on. Find out what works for you. Set it up and every time you play, you gotta warm up. So we have developing consistent practice habits and developing a consistent warm-up routine. But there's something else that can cause you to play inconsistently in the moment. A lack of mental stability. <laughs> if you're prone to tilt, then one loss can make you mad and mess you up. And one victory can cause you to get overconfident. This is a deep issue. I can't fix your brain. But if this is you, then the first step to fixing it is recognizing it and admitting it. In the last solo queue episode, when I get killed by a player who I know that I'm better than, I may not be better than them, but I know that I'm better than them. That's what tilts me. I get killed in a dumb way or something like that, and I lose the ability to make good decisions and I play like garbage. One thing that's really helped for me is recognizing when it's happening so that I can take steps to minimize the damage. Try this. The next time you feel you're tilting, Take your headphones off, close your eyes, and breathe deeply. Don't think of anything. It takes repetition. It's like a reset to your brain. It actually works really well. You know what also helps is yelling out a curse word really, really loud, but then the neighbors call the police. It's difficult to be consistent when you face inconsistent situations. You could get great teammates one game, garbage teammates the next. You could get smurf opponents one game and pushovers the next. 
You may lead yourself to believe that you're playing inconsistently, but in reality, it's just variance. It's just probability. It's just luck. I mean, the game even has luck in the shooting, right? You could get screwed by unfortunate spread. I want you also to remember that with rank decay and smurfing, rank means nothing. Forget about it. That Master Guardian player that 40 bombed your last game even though you're a supreme, probably plays in high level leagues and doesn't even play matchmaking that much. So his rank has decayed or he's smurfing. Th don't worry about it. If you're worried about consistency, look inward. Don't look outward. Remember, you can't control your circumstances. The only thing you can control is what you do. Consistency in preparation leads to consistency in performance. Some people ignore this. Some people ignore everything that I have just said and rely purely on raw talent. You will surpass them someday, but you gotta be diligent. Let me know in the comments if you like this kind of video. I'm trying new things out on the channel to see what sticks. Thank you very much for watching. I'm the War Owl and I still have no closer. The video on the left is the previous Matchmaking Academy. The video on the right is what the YouTube algorithm suggests, so probably Minecraft Let's Plays from 2011. Then you will kill them all! Ah! Ah! Ah!